what up, what up, y'all, and welcome back to The Art of Murder, FBI Confidential. We are up here at the Pre-Columbian Art Museum. That's our ride. Another look at there, okay. Nothing else to do, all right, let's go on in. A horrifying guard from the Aztec world. He is pretty ugly, huh? Nothing there. No description. A there. horrifying guard from the Aztec world. All right, what do we see? What do we see? They usually have some pretty interesting exhibitions here. I've always wanted to check out the gift shop here. The, the museum porter, who, according to Nick, is not so innocent. Sorry, ma'am. We're closed today until the end of the week. FBI. My name's Nicole Bonnet. I'm from the FBI. What? Hey, lady, I'm clean. Actually, I wanted to talk with the director. Director Warren? Yeah. Yeah. He in there? Where can I find him? Straight ahead. He's messing around in the main hall, you know. Look, lady, I don't know what you heard, but I ain't got nothing to do with it. What we presume is the shape of the murder weapon. All right, let's go to the main hall. <clears throat> Some of these exhibits sure are creepy. Dun, dun, dun. Who's this motherfucker? Is this the You get used to it. Did we say that shit out <laughs> Good morning to you. Good morning, sir. I'm Agent Bonnet from the FBI. You must Bonnet? be Director I can't Warren. Be the one and only. Might I say how glad I am the Bureau is finally paying attention and hiring more Jodie Foster like agents. Uh, thank you. Now then, what do you have Resistance here in the way of sacrificial daggers and so on? Can I ask why the FBI is interested in pre-Columbian art? Well, the type of knife I just described is possibly part of a murder investigation. Hmm, do you know anything about the murderer? I'm not at liberty to comment on that, so could you show me some knives? Certainly, Miss Bonnet. There's a display of obsidian Aztec knives in the main hall. Are we in the main hall? Very old, very beautiful. The priests used them when Cortez was a Tenochtitlan. Fascinating. And they're in the main hall here? Yes, it's Probably a popular right display. I think people like to imagine what they must have felt like. Grim stuff. What else you got for me? Now, if you'll excuse me, old bones don't catalog themselves, you know. Now, if you'll... Those Incans had such a great imagination, but there are mm. no knives with blades that look like our drawing. Look at that guy. It's like a little dude. That's like the same thing. This creature has a dent on its neck. Could have been caused by spears or school trips. Supposed to be missing its head? Okay. Scary looking mummy. Hope I don't end up like that. Oh, 
Extraordinary Ceramics. The way it's hanging around unprotected, it's probably just a replica. The way it's... I don't need it now. Hmm, need it now. Gas extinguisher. Looks to be in good condition. I'll walk around the museum with this pot, maybe put something out. Okay, well, we're gonna run into a fire, apparently. I don't need it now. I love these places. This is creepy as shit, actually. Is it a real pair? <clears throat> Doesn't look like it. No description. If these statues could talk, what would they say about that Mel Gibson picture? Which one is Mel Gibson in? Okay, we can go into the vases. So let's... This is potting soil for flowers and small plants. I may not be an expert florist, but I'd say this soil could be useful. I'm just gonna put some dirt in our pockets. Hey, whatever works. If these statues. I can't carry more than one vase. Okay, I don't know why we did that, but... I... Oh. Get more dirt. <clears throat> Bag of potting. This vase is already full. This is potting soil. All right, so now it's full of dirt. It's got a skull hmm. on it, right? This would not be clever. Hmm, this would not be clever. Hmm, this would not be clever. I can't carry more. This isn't a good idea. This face, this face is already full. These vases are he I don't know why I'm going to fill these up with dirt, but I'm going to. Because it lets me. If it lets me do something... This vase is... These vases... This face is already Okay. Okay. Now what? I can't carry I can't carry more than one vase. 
This face is already... Okay, there's a puzzle there. <clears throat> Is Warren spreading word about the old maps and his talks of expeditions with old friends? This magnifying glass is probably used for reading old, weathered maps. How about I try it one more time, but do it just a little differently? Only without the stupid jokes this time. Otherwise... This isn't a good idea. What about the dirt? Can we look at the dirt? Only without the stupid. Uh, okay, so bookshelf and magnifying glass is all we got. Okay. It must have been here that they did their scientific studies. Professor Dickinson's... Who's Professor Dickinson? Frankly, I've no idea what to do with it. Frankly. See, none of these are good. But look at this display case, too. Nothing's there. Well, nothing I can see that would help the investigation. Let's talk to this guy again. Hey, how'd it go? You talked to the boss? Yeah, but I didn't really find anything. Well, you know, we don't have everything on display. Sometimes we exchange items with other museums, you know. Oh, yeah? Can we show this to him? Yeah, it's similar to some of the others I've seen, but I don't know nothing more about it. Wait, wait, there's nothing to see in there. something in here maybe I don't need it now how about I try it one more time we don't need it now though so that's something for sure Oh shit, I didn't even see that. What does that do though? Got no clue what to fucking do. We've been everywhere. There's no knives. Are we just done here? See, there's nothing we can do in there.
Can we keep talking to this motherfucker? Oh yeah? Like <clears throat> down the road? In other states? Even other countries. We do a lot with South American museums and universities. In fact, I've just been packing a load of stuff for Bogota. Any knives or other kinds of weapons? Yeah, probably. It's part of the collection from upstairs in the main mm -hmm. hall. Okay. Can I see them? Well, now I'm not sure I can... Let me talk to your boss. Give me his number. I'll call him. Uh, yeah, okay. His number is... Five, 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 three, six, two, six, nine, one. Three, two, six, yeah. Three, two, one. Unfortunately, he must have switched off his mobile. Huh, no reply. Well, I'm afraid my hands are tied. Uh, sorry, lady. Oh, that's a shame. If I don't solve this knife case thing, I'll be doing regular duties again. Probably chasing old drug busts with Nick Romsky. Uh, well, you know, if you just want to look around a bit... Mm. You know, I, I'm sure that'd be, you know... Oh, really? Thank you, sir. That'd be such a help. Oh, That's man, real huh? sweet of you. I won't be long. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, through these doors here, just like, don't touch anything, okay? It's almost pitch black down here. I'll ask the porter to turn on the lights. Really? What's wrong with the light down there? I don't know. I'm a porter, not an electrician. So how am I supposed to see anything? You're not. Sometimes it works. You gotta jiggle it. One up, one down, or something like that. Where is the light? Is this the light? What a relic. It's older than the stuff on display. One up, one down, he said. Oh, I don't like these kind of puzzles. There's no rhyme or reason to any of this. Is there any hints here? We got a positive and a negative. Clickety click click click. No, oh, did I get it working? Look, lady, I don't know.
See, we're missing one. It'd be good if I could take a look around, but I can't see in the dark. Ah, we gotta make a path back there. So let's take that one off. What about you? Oh, it does everything. This is probably only one of the stops in the travels of Warren's historical treasures. What's up with the poster? Collecting curiosities. Geez, this poster is almost a museum piece itself. What shall I do with it? Smash Why isn't this Smash it open, damn it. A sealed crate, very heavy and very suspicious. This crate is so heavy, I need muscles on my muscles to shift it. This crate Fortunately, there's nothing on Key word is yet. I had no idea one vase could have so many, uh, pieces. I had no idea one. So we gotta get into that crate. This crate is. I can see a narrow gap between the two crates. What does that do for us? What shall I do with it? A dinghy. Some rubbery thing, curled up like a cat. It might be useful, but damned if I can see for what. Large, inflatable dinghy. Okay, so we're going to put that in the case. Case? Looks tough, like it's for something expensive. Wow, this is a heavy one. Can't be empty. Flight case type of thing for carrying guns, optical instruments, electronic devices, etc. It's not even closed. Let's take a look. Looks kind of Star Trek-y, like a little radar or something. Ah, it's an x-ray scanner. Very useful. They showed us one in training. Okay, so we're going to scan the... What else we got in there? Portable X-ray scanner. All right, so let's get back down here. <clears throat> no knives here.
the perfect place to shove a folded up dinghy. Okay, no, no, no. Inflate it. A rubber dinghy. I put in, I put out. It's very hard to find any kind of sense in it, isn't it? The perfect place to shove. Inflammable pressurized gas will inflate the dinghy. No, we can make sure this side of the crate is that what it is? No knives here. This crate is so heavy, I need. Well, these are in pairs, and look here, an empty space. Knife, like in our sketch. Bingo. So now we go talk to some folks. Let's try calling the old director Warren again. Unfortunate. <sighs> do you have an inventory for this stuff, or do I need to call the customs agents? Jeez, I knew it would come to this. Here you go, here's the paperwork. Ha! You see? Right there. Two ritual knives. Where's the second? I'll have to talk to Warren about this. Sure. Whatever you like, I'll probably get fired from all this anyway. Should we call this motherfucker yet? Unfortunately, he must have switched off his mobile. Look, lady, I don't know. Hmm. All right, apparently we got to put our ship back or they won't let us leave, so. Well, what do you know? All right, case came from, the knife came from the museum. You leave everything in order down there? Just as you left it. You can trust a Fed, right? I'm going to move the crate around a little bit. John Rudolph, stockbroker. We're on Staten Island today. It looks like one of yours. Go check it out. I'll come by later. Alright. Who'd think such an idyllic place could be a crime scene? Dun dun dun. Talk to Mr. Policeman. Evening, officer. Time, I'm Agent guys. Bonnet, FBI. Jeff McGregor, NYPD. Guess you got the short straw, huh? Yeah. The investigators already been. Yes, ma'am. Did their thing and took the body downtown. And you're? I'm waiting till the guy with the keys comes and locks up the building. How is it inside? 
It's a rich man's place, pretty tidy though. No sign of a struggle anywhere. And the victim? Killer gutted this guy like a fish, mm. right there on the pool table. Put his heart in the corner pocket. <laughs> I've seen a lot, but uh, I almost blew chunks at that. Vic must have been knocked out before the gory stuff happened, hmm? Guess so. Uh, CSI guys were talking about an injury at the base of the skull, but beyond that, I have no idea. Hmm. Well, thanks, McGregor. Guess I'll go take a look for myself. It's a pretty cool looking sky. Yeah, this is the biz. Old Victorian houses. Always wanted to live in one. There's a pool table, so that's where the... The matter. We got a lot of places to search here, it looks like, huh? Let's take a look at the table first. Front room. CSI took samples from the containers on the table. Photographer left an evidence number card behind. CSI took samples. Possible the perp was socializing with the victim. One bottle and one glass knocked over. Whiskey stains next to that. CSI took samples from the containers. This may be evidence. I can't just pick it up with my. What am I supposed to pick it up with? CSI took samples. It looks like the armchair was moved. Did the guys miss something? The armchair was too far from the table. What did we just uncover? There's a lot of knickknacks in here. Ooh, business oh, card. a business card. <laughs> There's a business card in here. I doubt it belonged to the murderer. You might have. Alan Branford, collector. There's a phone number. Maybe I'll call him tomorrow. Alan Branford. Alan Branford. Do clocks stop when their owners die? This one survived a few already. Huh. Real or fake? All right, I don't see anything else in this main room. So let's wrap it up right here, guys. Drop a like if you haven't already. Drop a sub if you're new. I'm out.